Hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, depending on where you are watching from. Welcome to the channel and welcome to today's video. This is Stream Media UG, where we love to stream and flow with you. Now, as you have already seen from the title, I am addressing this matter of when one is in a situation of hopelessness where you think like giving up is the only alternative that you have or where you think that giving up will be the best thing for you to do. My dear, there are more than a thousand reasons for you to keep hanging on in that situation. And I'm not saying that you should fall in love with what's tormenting you or what's bothering you. But all I'm saying is that you need to hang in on there. Hang on. Don't give up. Don't surrender and don't give in. Here are the reasons as to why you need to hang in there. It never rains forever. And this or that show shall pass. It can never ever rain forever. It doesn't matter how long it has taken you to keep in that situation. It matters not how painful it has been. But the thing is, giving up, surrendering, giving away your power, is not going to take away the situation but embracing what you are going through with confidence that any time you're going to get out of that you know misery that situation of lack that situation of maybe disappointment heartbreak or whatever it is is the only way that you are going to get out of that situation you know peacefully now if you're going through a hard time and eventually, you feel like, no, I need to give up, my dear. I am to, I'm here to let you know that eventually that situation is going to pass. And if you hang in on there, you are going to get out through it in a victorious manner. So be patient. Don't give up and don't give in. Don't throw away your power to the wind because the wind is going to obviously take it away from you and that will sometimes make the end of you or maybe will make you lose all that that you were about to hit. I mean your jackpot, your success, your breakthrough. Remember you are worthwhile. You are special. Hold on. Hold your breath. Be positive. You know, things are going to get better. And you know what? Once you feel better, once you get out of that situation, then you are going to be the best person to talk to some other person, to lift somebody up who is in a bad situation or somebody who is in a situation which is even worse than the one in which you are facing today. So don't worry. Take a day at a time. I know things can go bad. Things can go weird. Things can go crazy. Things can go south. But at the end of the day, you'll get out of that situation. So take things easy. Take things slowly. You know, practice, you know, great self-care. Immerse yourself in anything that makes you feel good. Anything that elates you. Stay away from people who deflate you, who take away your joy, who take away your peace and happiness. Believe in yourself, but above all, believe in God. Because with him, everything is possible. Yeah, believe in yourself, but above all, believe in God, because he knows the end right from the beginning. So wrap yourself in love. Treat yourself the best way that you can, you know. Pay attention to yourself. 
do to yourself all those things that you would do to somebody you treasure the most in this world. Embrace who you are. It's just an episode. It shall pass as well. I know you have come a long way. And you still have a long way to go. But now is not the right time for you to give up. Because giving up will mean losing everything that you have worked for, everything that you have stood for, and everything that you have believed in right from the beginning till the stage where you are right now. So don't give up. I don't give in. Don't surrender and don't throw away your power because this too shall pass. And hey, if you're here and you are yet subscribed, please kindly subscribe to this channel. It keeps me going and makes me fall in love more with doing what I am doing right now. And if you are in such a situation, learn to create time specifically for you to love to cherish to appreciate you know to speak positive affirmations in your life declare positivity in your life declare good things stay away from negativity don't declare anything negative upon your life upon anything that you are doing because what you affirm what you believe in what you give energy will obviously become strong and maybe end up either overpowering you or empowering you depending on what you are declaring or affirming in your life. So declare peace, declare love, declare good health even when you are feeling as sick as never before. Even when you are feeling more weaker or more weak than yesterday, declare that you are strong because he who is in you is strong stronger than he who shall ever be in this world now don't you ever think of giving up because there is there is always somebody somewhere in a worse situation than yours and you know what that person is still positive that person is optimistic that things are going to be fine. They are positive towards life and they are not considering giving up at all. Love means that you should as well feel fine because everything is going to fall into the right position at the right time and you shall definitely come to realize that you were almost giving up for no reason so today tomorrow and any other time take a day at a time start to be happy with who you are give energy to only things that are positive the things that are going to build you neglect reject anything that drains away your energy Anything that speaks negativity in your life, anything that seems to be, you know, taking you away from the right direction. Because giving up is never going to be a solution. Yeah, thank you so much for watching today's video. And if you have watched until this time, I highly, highly appreciate you. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up. So that YouTube can be able to recommend it to many other people to watch it. And if you are yet subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing to this channel so that we can stream and flow with you. And if you're meeting me for the very first time, my name is Rachel. I love you and I wish you nothing but the very best. Thank you. And until then, bye for now.